also talk about a very quite interesting uh, report that uh, transpired last week and that is when the hunter becomes the hunted and if that happens something is seriously amiss well the police are angry right now over the detention and torture of some policemen accused by some vigilantes of selling indian hemp in okay. edo state and the two self-acclaimed policemen were seen handcuffed in a viral video after the illicit drugs were allegedly discovered in their vehicle. Let's share that video with you. Torino, what? Can you imagine? Police officers, you are even into, into drug distribution. You have cannabis in your vehicle that you are distributing. This is loud. This is one of the costliest police officers weed right now in the country. It's so expensive, five thousand a wrap. That's what they sell. Look at the nylon. They are into the selling. They sell because they have nylon. They have everything. They deal. Okay, the, uh, wow. Unbelievable. Now you run from fry pan to fire now. You will open this one for us. Who are these ones? I think we are going to get it. Okay. It's okay now. We are, we are on it. We are on it. Who are these ones? Who are these? Who are these? Okay, I'm not in my head this year. Yes, no. Hey, man, you sure you get it? Yeah, I beg. Those people, they can clearly come. I beg, me, they are in the who was this one? I'm my own. I'm my own. I'm my own. I'm my own. Okay. You did not turn that into the station. It doesn't matter. Okay. It doesn't matter. No, 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 and we, we are, are all working towards one cause. We are not police haters. We are family. No, 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 no worry. Is it motto? Yes. That's why they molest me. I'm not good. 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 i am not good 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 i am not I want to ask him, how did you get this car? It's my friend's car. Mm. Your friend will get this one. Please, your friend. You know this car will come here. Yes, you should be invited. And that video or that story now has more twists as the police in Edo State is uh, now saying that um, they're investigating the matter. Those are actually policemen, but the vehicle in which uh, they were said to have been uh, riding in at the time doesn't belong to them. Sam, what do you make of this? A very disturbing story. Um, but that's, that's our country for you. Uh, but I, I, I wouldn't want to go with the mob. I know that... Um, we have very serious challenges with um, uh, the Nigerian police, but that does not completely rubbish that institution. We also know that there are indeed um, good policemen and women who have acquitted themselves you know, over time. So you will continue to have elements uh, like this, not just within the police, but across most of our security you know, um, setups who um, have turned themselves into collaborators, you know, in criminal activities. Uh, this stands to be, you know, highly c condemned um, because trade in illicit drugs is not one that um, is, is permitted with, within our society. So one cannot, you know, um, uh, support, you know, um, developments of, of this of this of this kind. Absolutely. Yeah, so what what needs to be done basically is to is to have uh, these suspects, you know. Um, uh, prosecuted within within the um, limits of, of of the law, um, I wouldn't I wouldn't subscribe to jungle justice, and I I think that what we need to do at all times is to ensure that our judicial processes you know uh, uh, are allowed to 
um, play out rather than people taking laws into their hands. All right. We hear that vigilantes were the ones involved in, in the arrest. So, like you said, when the hunter becomes uh, the hunted, but we would like justice to prevail. They should be properly tried, you know, prosecuted, and uh, allowed to have their time. All right. Wale, what, what's your take before we, uh, you know, dive into the major business well, of the day? I, I think it's an embarrassment, but it's not also strange. We have seen many cases where law enforcement against are also lawbreakers. Just me are driving on the street, you see that where you are not supposed to take one way. You see somebody wearing a police uniform or army uniform, you will be taking out in lane and nothing happens to him. So we have seen such instances. But that does not mean that um, we need to rubbish the institutions. It means that we need to help them to be able to be more responsive to public needs. And uh, we are talking about, you know, the police needs to improve on its background checks in terms of recruitment. When you are recruiting people there, you need to do a lot of background check to know who they were before joining the force. And uh, here we also see the power of the social media because this could have been denied. If not for the fact that we are, people are able to see it. So policemen should be very careful because you never, you never know who is taking your images. So they need to be very careful when they are performing public functions. Well, we'll see how it all plays out in the end. Of course, uh, many people are going to be watching now to see how, now that these uh, police officers are said to be suspect, how uh, this will be resolved, especially with, with drugs uh, you know, being in the mix.